I am joined now by local musician and friend Leah Foner. Leah, thank you so much for being here. How are you? Thanks for having me. I'm doing good. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. All right, Leah, I want to know, how did your personal musical journey start? Yeah, um, well, I think it just starts with falling in love with music in general mm -hmm. and just being really connected to it. Mm -hmm. And I loved performing, too, as a kid. So I would perform for family, um, write songs, and <laughs> perform them for them. And um, eventually I started playing like open mic nights, playing live around town, and I would do covers um, and then became more confident in original music. Mm -hmm. And I just, yeah. yeah. And here you are. Yeah, uh-huh, <laughs> yeah. So I feel like you have a very um, different and kind of unique um, tone and sound to your voice and the, and the music that you and your band perform. So who would you say some of your like original early influences were? Yeah. Um, Number one is definitely the Beatles. Okay. Um, I think most people, the Beatles are like <laughs> their first love. Um, definitely for me um, and other artists of that time period. So definitely the Beatles and Bob Dylan okay. are number one for me. Okay, mm -hmm. really interesting choices, but I feel like that makes a lot of sense for the music that you perform. Yeah. Yeah? Oh yeah. Um, so you mentioned songwriting a little bit. Yeah. So what's songwriting, songwriting like for you? Cause I know that for everyone, it's kind of like a different process. Yeah, different for everyone, but also different every time you write a song, mm. to be honest. Um, first and foremost, it's storytelling. Yeah. So I write everything down. If someone says a weird phrase or something I've never heard, I write it down. I have, I have tons of notebooks, okay. um, write everything okay. down. Um, I always kind of am working on melodies. If, if there's something I like, I'll just record it on my phone really quick, and then eventually the lyrics and the music can come together. Um, one of the most rewarding but frustrating things about songwriting is it can take a really long time sometimes, mm. and then other times it can you can write one in a day. Yeah. You know? so, I've had songs I started five years ago that I finished this year. <laughs> right. So, yeah. Yeah, it's different with every song. It really is. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so you obviously are the lead singer of your band, but you mm -hmm. formed your band, Leah Fauner and the Flower Power. So tell me how this came to fruition. Yeah, actually, I guess it kind of started during the pandemic. Okay. Um, we wanted to make an album, and I, my drummer, Kevin, He's really good with the production side of things, the mixing, mastering, all of that. So during the pandemic, I would just send him recordings, mm -hmm. like guitar, vocals, um, and then lead guitar stuff. And then he would take that and create a full song. Like he has like anything you can think of. So drums, bass, he can do it all. Mm -hmm. um, and he would take the simple song I sent and make it like a full song, like it's a full band. And so we did an album like that and 2021, we started doing gigs together with okay. him and then our guitar player, Zach, my sister, Lynette, she's an amazing musician. She plays like 10 instruments. So yeah. <laughs> um, it just seemed natural. Mm -hmm. We all just start playing together. So yeah. it kind of just formed very naturally, organically, and it's been so fun. Yeah, well, you guys make mm -hmm. amazing music together. So <laughs> thank you. <laughs> all right, so um, where do you hope to maybe see your career go in these next few years? Um, well, definitely always making albums, okay. always writing more music. Um, we are working on an album now. Um, and actually, we would love to go on a tour Ooh, as well. Okay. That's something we're talking about. So That's those are my stuff. goals right now. Yes, OK, yeah, I love that. So. All good stuff. All right, mm -hmm. so Leah, you and your band recently performed on the show with your original song called Coney Island. So let's yes, check out this yeah. performance. Okay. Shells over to the bookshelf, invisible spectator. There we are standing while he's demanding the measurements of our skirts. Tired of headaches, watching your soul break. We're sorry, so it's still. So wait down the next truck, or we'll stick our thumbs up to hit your ride. to the teacups I'll pick flowers from your hair and it's not black the wind's gonna blow and pull you away from me cause I'll hold you as tight as I can that's where you'll always be on Coney Island at least to me
Absolutely love that song. Thank Brilliant you. job on that. Thank you. Yes, Leah, it's such a pleasure getting to speak with you. You're just such a fun person to speak to in general. You are so. too. <laughs> thank you, thank you. All right, Ozark's Live will be right back.